Coach Leggington, uh, he's an outstanding guy, uh, does a wonderful job around this building, not only in the classroom as it relates to engaging in the instructional process and getting students to really appreciate and understand art and what that means, but also as a mentor and a guide to students, uh, both male and female, in the context of how to be a professional, how to set a goal and, and have a vision of what you want to do long term. Uh, he embodies all of those things because of, I guess, of his own uh, his own experiences, and he brings those experiences to to the building every single day. Now, yes, we are we are very appreciative to have Coach Legan in here for the work that he does with students at Wilma Hutchins High School. But he also serves as a great example to his peers and to his colleagues. He's a young man that goes above and beyond the work that he has to do in the classroom as a teacher, uh, in the sense of working with students and talking with students in the hallway, in the cafeteria, serving as a coach in both volleyball and track. Uh, just involved in, 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 a new, in, a, in a number of different things here at the building, and we appreciate everything that he brings to our school community. Uh, coach Leggington is one of those guys that we call a, a jewel, a diamond, and the greatest compliment that, that I think as a principal that I can give uh, to this outstanding educator is that if my daughter or my son was at this school, I would love for them to be in Coach Leggington's classroom. Right, watching him and watching his wife, you know, his kids attend school here, and just watching his interactions with people, you know, it just kind of gravitated to him. He's a great father figure. He's a great mentor. Uh, the kids love him. They get along with him just fine. Uh, but he's also firm. But he shows love at the same time. Uh, not just here at the school, but that's at his home too. I know his family, I know his wife and his children. Um, and he, he exemplifies that in every manner, no matter where he's at, whether it's the school, whether it's the church house, whether it's out in an opening or setting or whatever it may be. Right after a game uh, or after practice, he waits until the last baby leaves. He's always, you know, if they need a ride or if they, you know, if they need anything, he's just always about them. And then they respect that and, and they know that he respects them. Same thing with the spoken word um, students that he has. Um, he took, takes a very personal interest in those babies because he's, you know, forcing them to write, and not forcing them to write, but, you know, having them to open up about, you know, anything that's going on with them, which is, you know, a soft spot for me because I work with children as well. Been knowing him for 13 years, and there's never been a time where he's just not being there with a smile on his face. Um, He's always positive. He's gonna find um, a struggle and a positive out of a struggle. It, he, he's, there's no words. Um, just a great person, inside and out. I would like people to know about my dad, that he's a great father figure in my life and that he's a good coach. And he likes to push people to be Well, Coach Leggington, you know, he looks the part. He talks the part. He walks the part. He embodies professionalism. And you know, when we talk about what our community needs, uh, particularly in the African American community or the minority community here in the Metroplex and across the country. Coach Leggington embodies all of that in the sense of how he carries himself. Coach Leggington has it figured out. He knows what you need to do. Again, we're very, very proud to have Coach Leggington with us.